This weapon was not designed to kill, but to deter unwanted visitors. It's a laser that reaches 500 metres in daylight and one kilometre at night. A warning system, it's aimed at protecting naval bases and detecting pirates and traffickers. If the laser is beamed at you, it feels like you have direct sunlight in your eyes. Carrying on your journey would be very difficult. An innocent fisherman would stop, but a pirate would likely speed up because he knows he's been spotted, so we would deal with that threat differently. The small firm, based in Brittany, expects to sell 100 models next year. Like the 400 other companies at the Euro Naval Fair, it wants to capitalize on the global demand for high-tech naval equipment. DCNS, the leader in France, says its latest frigate is fully digital and can repel cyber attacks. You have the uh, conventional threats above water, the missiles, the aircraft, the other ships, and the cyber threat. Uh, she takes into account uh, all the new threats and the new constraint of a warship at sea. And drones are not confined to the skies. Thales is hoping to equip warships with this underwater stealth drone. If you carry mine hunting missions, you're very close from the mines, so it's very dangerous. So if you can do it with drones, it's much safer for the people that are far away. This is what we bring with this autonomy. The drone was developed with 19 small businesses in Brittany. More than 700 French firms are working to take their share of the global naval market.